All right, so in this video, we're going to look at the average ifs function. Uh, there's also an average if, but this is average ifs with the s. Now, I do have a video video on average if. You can check my YouTube channel under. Uh, there's a I'll have a playlist with Excel statistical functions. Uh, so you know you can check those out. I plan on adding more videos to it. So what we want to do here is we want to average this column, but I want to set some criteria. I want it to average just the east territory. Okay, so you can see there's three on the east, but also I want it to average just for Joe. Okay, so you can see that would be this one. There's East and Joe, and then this one, East and Joe. See, there's an East and John. I don't want it to include that. Okay. So, <clears throat> we hit equals, and then average ifs in parentheses. <clears throat> All right. So, let's put the criteria in. Okay. All right, so first is the average range. What do I want to average? Well, that would be these values, okay? Now, it's going to be subject to the conditions that it's East and Joe. So it's basically going to be this value and this value, okay? All right, so I'm going to hit comma, and now it's ready for my criteria range 1. So the first criteria, it has to be east. Well, it's going to get that from this column. Okay, This is the column that it's going to look up east. Okay, Now I hit comma, and now it wants to know criteria 1. All right, well, that's east. I want it to look up east. So we'll type in east and put it in quotes and then comma. So it's going to average this column and it's going to look up in this column east. Now my second criteria it has to be Joe. Alright so that's my criteria range 2. Alright so that is this column. That's the column it's going to look up next. Okay, And then comma and what's criteria 2? Well, that's Joe. It's that one and that one. So we'll tell it to look up Joe. Put that in quotes. And close the parentheses. Now, let me show you this. Now you can see that there's a criteria range 3. So if you had more, you could add another one. Okay. Close the parentheses and enter. And this would be the average. Okay. That's the, this is the average of this cell and this cell. Okay. And you can see you can see right here, see how it matches. But and yes, it's easy just to select those two, but you know, you might have a long list and you can't go through and select them. But that's the that's the average ifs function. Okay? You select you select the you select the, the range you want it to average, and then the range where it looks up the first criteria, and then you list the first criteria, and then it's the range of the where you want it to look up the second criteria, and then you list the second criteria. And if you need more, you can just add them. Okay? All right, so I hope this video helped. Give me a like, subscribe, check out my other videos, and thanks for watching.